Hey, welcome back. We're back on Zomboid. We continue uh, with um, Jefferson. We uh, we left off yesterday trying to get a uh, welding mask and a sledgehammer from that little industrial um, park close to, uh, well, in between Rosewood and uh, Muldraw, right? We'll have to go back. We still got to secure the uh, the house here is why we did it in the first place, right? Need some security, some house security. Uh, let's watch ourselves. And let's wash all of our clothing as well. We're pretty tired, we're gonna go to bed. Uh, I think all this stuff is fine, right? Because it was raining yesterday? Well watered, yeah. Well watered, flourishing. These tomatoes are currently in a state of flourishment. And we have some carrots here too. Very exciting. Everybody loves carrots. Okay. I think we also came back with uh, a couple of bits and pieces too, didn't we? We have a wood axe now. Which we can put onto the ground. Maybe we could use this to actually chop down wood. We got a hand axe that we can put onto the ground. We got a propane torch that we're carrying around with us. It's not necessary. Some thread, some nails. Don't need those either. We got loads of gardening stuff, which is nice. Cabbage, carrot, potato, radish, and strawberry seeds. Very good. Um, there's two sacks here as well. Could grab those for dirt some other time. And then we got a couple of uh, bits and pieces of food too. Just like some honey and stuff like that. Oops. Put all these sacks on the ground. Got five sacks down there now. I think we're almost at the point now where we don't even need this generator to be running. I mean, it's nice to have lights, but in terms of actually keeping stuff fresh, a lot of it's just going bad, isn't it? got some rotten ground beef, some rotten meat patties, some rotten steak, we've got some stale uncooked salmon, which you could try to do something with. Maybe we could pop it into a stir fry. Let's get a couple of eggs in here too. And um, let's get some packaged corn. A double helping. Bit of lard. Bit of hot sauce. Get some lemon and lime in here too. Give it a nice zest. Margarine. A sprinkle of pepper. There, I think that's pretty good. All right, let's uh, cook this thing. Let's put the empty bowl uh, into here in a sec. Oh. I don't know how they know that I'm even in here to start wailing away on my shit. I guess it must just be the generator, right? Let 
Yeah. It's actually every time. It's got it's got to be the generator. It's it's the deck. You must be attracted. Yeah, they must be attracted to the deck realistically. All right, just in time. We almost burnt the place down. All right, so this, uh, we can uh, eat half of it. Put that in there. Fill our empty water bottles with whatever water is left in this sink. And then let's put some of this rotten stuff in here. Empty bowl, hammer, pipe wrench, tailoring two. We got some coffee on us that we can, we can always eat it if we're getting tired tomorrow, right? We should go to bed, it's 12.30. Okay, no more visitors in the night. If we need a if we need a pick me up later in the day, we can eat coffee. That could be good. It could be a good one for us. Okay, let's eat this. Uh, let's put this stuff away, and let's take with us um, some canned peaches. We could always just eat those while we're out today, and maybe a canned potato as well. Oh, and I want to put the griddle, the griddle pan back. Just chew on a little cheeky bit of coffee. Yeah, why not, eh? Okay, we're gonna head back out. We're gonna head back out to uh, to the spot and hope... There's a couple more buildings to check and there's definitely some more zombie clearing to do, right? This axe is not in incredible condition. Oh yeah, we parked back here this time, didn't we? But there's a spare axe in the back of the truck. Is canned potatoes a thing? It's absolutely a thing. We can listen to the radio on the way. See if there's any helicopters or anything that we need to be aware of. Almost hit him. Now we don't want to go too fast because we don't want any head on collisions. There are definitely some zombies on this road.
please read Dowie's message about RimWorld DLC? Uh, what is the new DLC? They Have they announced some new DLC? Nice. Okay, I'll check it out after. I haven't uh, heard about it. The new DLC is horror themed? Oh, neat. Maximum temperature is 29 degrees today. Oh shit, whoops. Clear skies, so no rain. Tomorrow, the humidity is 62%. Jeez. With some clouds. And some fog. So tomorrow night is going to rain again. Heavy rain as well, by the sounds of it. All right. Good. No helicopter today either, by the looks of it. There's still a lot of zombies around here. Killed some of them. There's not enough of them. There's still some other warehouses to check. Okay, we've arrived. Let's try to sneak around a little bit. Make the fights a little bit fairer for ourselves. Oh, this has been knocked open. Nice. Okay, that should give us a bit of bite protection too, right? All right, let's see if there's anything in these crates in here. There's a hard hat. There's a gravel bag. There's a, another sack. A small metal sheet. Don't need that. There's a box of screws. A crowbar, a hammer. Loads of cleaning products. Gravel bag in here too. There's one more box. All right, we'll go back out the way that we came in because I don't know what the situation is out there by the car. The car is the last thing that made noise, so anything that was following it will have followed it all the way up, but it doesn't appear to be anything in here. JP started solo Zomboid playthrough yesterday, and he survived for six days so far. Nice. Yeah, he messaged me today and said that he's been enjoying uh, solo, but I didn't realize he'd survived that long. That's good. Because I think he played multiplayer mostly, right? I've never played multiplayer in this game. Actually, I think I did once. I remember I remember um, Jacob being in, in the game as well. But that was before it was like 
officially supported, I think. Oh, good. Nothing followed us over here, so we had a good chance to take a look. All right, there's another building that we want to have a look in. I believe it's this one. Let's turn off the car and just try to sneak around a bit. There are some hordes around here. Cigarettes. Yes. Hello. Hopefully we have some luck in this place. This is, I think, where we found stuff last time. It's in one of these, wasn't it? Pipe wrench, rope, hammer, plank, wood glue we'll take. Screws? I don't know. Do we need screws? We'll definitely take seed packets. It looks like that door is missing, so we'll have to be very careful. Stuff sneaking in on us. Oh, okay, this is quite good. It's really heavy, but its uh, they're quite rare, aren't they, the antique ovens? Quite good for like a longer term survival, if we ever make it that far. I hear somebody. There's loads of doors missing here. Did somebody follow us in? No, okay. Must just be somebody on the other side of this door or something, I don't know. I'll take all these boxes of nails because why not? Duct tape and stuff too. Nope. I think there's a whole bunch of them on the other side here. Club hammer, no, no mask, no sledgehammer. There's a machete. Another box of nails. All right, nothing in here. Oh, hello.
I'll eat these chips. Why not? All right, let's see who's actually out here at the moment. Knocking on these doors, these guys. All right, and then we can uh, we can bring the van over. It's uh, forty encumbrance for the antique oven, right? I will go get that machete. Wherever it was. I can't even, uh, I can't even carry it. <laughs> I think I'd have to come back here with, uh, way less stuff on me. Okay, we'll mark it. We'll mark this building, and then we know it's here. I think there's some crates in here, too. Soaked in sweat because I got this jacket on now. Planks, concrete powder, propane torch. No. I mean, I could come back and get propane torches for sure, but. Snow shovel, rake, take those. Nope. Loads of paint. I mean, more. More nails than I'll ever know what to do with. Another wood axe. I will take that. Nope. Oh, there's an upstairs to this bit too. There's a little mini fridge here, too. here so we've searched this place this one and this one uh, antique oven
There's another place down here. It's a little bit busier than the others. Oh, this is a mechanics place, right? It might be worth a check. And I think there's another little something or other down here, too. It's quite busy. It's this building down here. It's a big one. It might be worth a check, eh? Got to get rid of some of this weight. Okay, that's better. All right, let's see if we can actually open some of these doors. It's all locked up back here. Hey, Yogscast, thanks so much for the raid. What's up, raiders? We were almost stranded. <laughs> it almost did not want to start. Ooh, what's this? There's a container out here. See if we can find a way in here. Where'd you come from? Yeah, there is a busted door here. Uh, this has a couple of cardboard boxes in it, but nothing, nothing substantial. Free cowboy hat, though? It's like a construction site, which could be good. There's a pickaxe here. Shovel. A little tired. Looks like there's an upstairs bit.
No, nope. nothing in there. Ew. <laughs> Yuck. Pickaxe is very good. I think it's worth taking. I'll take it. Nope, nothing up here. Does this place not have a roof? I don't know if we can actually get into this thing. Oh yeah, it looks like maybe the other side. Oh. Loads of planks. Yeah, we found the whole plank stash. I guess these are the building materials. I'll just take a couple. I mean, I don't need to take tons of them. is this place done and this little container we haven't been to this uh, auto shop so nothing up here we're tired as well might be just time to head home It is 8.30 at night. It's a little bit past my bedtime. Mm -hmm. Well, she... No welding mask or sledgehammer. Last uh, last time we played uh, and and made it to there, we got both of them there. There's an antique oven over there though, which is pretty good. We can go pick it up at some point. We need to find like a hardware store or a tool store or like a construction site or something. I mean, I think they can appear 
pretty much anywhere. We still need to go down to the uh, school and get some more books as well, right? It's another task for us to uh, to do. He's coming. Oh shit. Run for your lives. Another wood axe. I'm, I'm actually too scared to go in. I'm going in. You never know what's what the state of play is going to be in this place. Okay, it's still boarded up, thank god. There's been no attacks, luckily. Jeez. Jesus. Okay.
I think we should be reasonably safe. I hope. I'm gonna open this canned potato and eat the whole thing. It's gonna rain tomorrow night. So the uh, so that industrial area is a little bit of a a washout. There isn't. Uh, I mean, we've got lots of nails. So if it's foggy tomorrow too, isn't it? It's a foggy day. Good day to catch up on some tailoring. Oh, I missed that. Some clouds, light fog. Period of weather predicted to start in the night, expecting showers and or heavy rain. It's already started raining. Clear skies, periodical cloudy spells. Weather predicted to start in the evening, light to moderate rain. That's tomorrow, okay. Oh. the hell? Okay, tailoring two is done. Which means that skill-wise now, we can... Uh, Train some more tailoring. We still don't have farming one, if you can believe that. How's our weight looking? 78 and rising. Okay, good. We got two wood axes and a couple of hand axes. Okay, let's do a little bit, since the weather is so bad, let's do a bit of um, tailoring, shall we? This uh, leather jacket is in pretty bad condition. It looks like there's holes in the upper and lower torso.
listening out for knocking at the door? I thought that was a knock. It was just the music. Nice. Tailoring three. So we need 750 XP to hit, hit tailoring four. So far, so good. No knocking at the door. It's actually a good day to do this because it's... Um It's such, uh, it's such bad weather out there. Okay, ripped sheets. We've actually used them all up. No, it's the thread that we've used up, actually. We've used up all of our thread. Incredible. Do 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 I'm adding all of the eggs to this. We're almost at the point now where I think we can turn the uh, generator off, which should help us out a little bit. We shouldn't have too many unwanted visitors. I just ate the whole thing. You eat all these peaches as well. Get ourselves well fed, why not? <laughs> Add some coffee to the stir fry? a good idea uh, right griddle pan can go back empty tin can so we got packaged corn stale remoulade remoulade boredom and unhappiness I don't know if we can add that to something we got some stale milk we got margarine we got some stale ground beef and we got some butter in here too that's all that we have left and then we have loads of non-perishables Do we actually have a baking pan? No. And look at all these vitamins. Holy crap. I didn't realize I had all these down here. Alright, now we have a baking pan. Alright, so we need to rip up more um, zombies. Let's see what the weather is. Uh, tomorrow, I think it's raining again, right?
Okay, let's see what it says. Trapping and fishing are non-existent. Okay, heavy rain tonight. Tomorrow, clear skies with periodical cloudy spells. And then in the evening, more rain. But that's So that's tomorrow. Okay. This axe is in worse and worse condition. How's our weight looking? 79? Okay, we're going to try to maintain it around here, I think. Would be a good one, right? Can you clean the glass? Pick up broken glass? Yeah, I guess you can. What new dance did we get? Hip Hop 2? Must be Hip Hop 2, right? This is the new one. I'm gonna get cuts, bleed out, and die? Oh, hell no, what are you talking about? Alright, let's see what the situation is down at this school now. There were lots of zombies. We killed some some of them, but not all of them. There should still be quite a few left. Blah. Somebody just um, screamed in terror. Okay, we got nine threads from all that.
We got 11 from that one. It's pretty good. We got six from that one. Yuck. I'm in eight more. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Let's have a quick smoke. <laughs> Celebrate our big victory. How's the zombie barbecue uh, patio coming along? Yeah, good. Yeah, it's, it's good. Oh shit, I forgot to drop off a lot of uh, stuff actually. gonna eat this whole can of chili. All right. Good. Okay, at last, we've made it to this library. make a start on oh let me get my uh my document open actually hang on a second documents i actually called this one jefferson.txt <laughs> jefferson.txt we don't need much actually we might be able to finish our book collection from here using jefferson.txt okay so we're looking for cooking four, electricity four and five, farming one, first aid five, fishing four, foraging four, metal five, tailor five, and trapping three. We've already read this. Uh, foraging four is here. So we can knock that off the list. Perfect. Um, yep. Forging two, fishing three, Carpentry, nope, I don't need any of those. Trapping, I need three. Okay, I'll take that off the list. I need tailoring. Oh, uh, it's not fishing one that I need, it's farming one that I need. And first aid five. Okay, we'll take that as well. That's another one off the list. Nice, nice, nice. Um, we haven't read Electronics Magazine Volume 1, so let's take it. Uh, electrician 4 and 5 we need. they got 2 and 3 here. Uh, first aid, we don't need any. Foraging, how to use generators. We've already read it, but good to know that it was here as well. We would have uh, finally got it. Okay, nothing in this one. Okay, this is unread. Carpentry 3, Fishing 2. We need Fishing 4. 
This is already red. This is unread. Forging one. Um, cooking four we need. That's already red. Um, and metal five. Tailoring five as well. Okay. So that's all those checked. Hello? Already red. Farming five. No, we need farming one. We need fishing four. Okay, nothing there. Carpentry, metal, we need five. Cooking one, ah, farming one, at last. Okay, farming one, good. We need that. And then we need a good cooking magazine as well. Always. Um, and then we need a bunch of volume fives for, for things. Volumes four and five for, so we need volumes four for cooking, fishing, and electrician, and volumes five for electrician, metalworking, and tailor. Uh, mechanics five, we don't need. There's a dance magazine here, I'll grab it. That's already been read. That's already been read. Carpentry four, foraging four, no, we don't need foraging four. First aid, we don't need first aid. And last bookcase, couple of dance magazines we'll take them okay great actually worked out pretty good I'm out of here Um, hey, Echo Tech 97 thanks so much for the 500 bits. Have you ever thought of playing the construction sim that came out in 2022? I'm sure I have, yeah. Whoa. Did you guys hear me vandalizing your school? There's a house down here, by the way, that uh, I was looking at the map earlier just to, you know, get some inspirations and ideas. And there is a house... Uh, where is it? I think it's along this road. It's a big house completely surrounded by... Oh, it's not big fence, though. It's like hoppable fence. Ah, uh, okay. I thought it was like big unhoppable fence, you know? I can hear lots of zombies back here. Look at these cool garden plots. Good cooking. Volume 2. Whoa. Yeah, I thought that this might be like a cool house to um to to build at, but it does not seem to be actually that great. Oops, I've done it again.
Nice shed, yeah. Right, that's all I wanted to look at, really. There's a couple of other houses here. There's a empty one here, I think, for sale. Do we loot any of these? Yeah, we looted this one, it looks like. During our adventures. Alright, well nice. We got a we did a nice uh, book run there. We got um farming one, which is great. We'll need uh we'll want the multiplier for when stuff is ready to be harvested, right? We got loads of seeds. I think it's gonna rain tonight too, so it might be worth planting some more some more crops, and then we get a free um low effort water of the crops of the crops I got a bunch of thread too it's good I think I saw somebody. Maybe not. I'm sure I saw someone. Oh, well, we'll know if the rope disappears in a sec. Terry. I'm always scared to go in now because I, I don't know what to uh, to expect. You know, I don't know if I'm just going to be walking into a big trap. What am I um, holding that's at the moment so heavy? Oh, I can probably put this on the ground. Maybe that'll be enough for me to be able to just do the wood. No, okay. I guess it's just all of the um, planks. Okay, it seems safe enough for now. Yeah, okay, nothing's in here, I don't think. All the doors, <laughs> I can't wait to get rid of these stairs. God, it's going crazy in here. Alright, I don't think we're going to have enough room on one bookcase for the entire collection of books, sadly. That would have been great. we got all of these... Forging four. Uh, maybe we, maybe we might actually. You know all these magazines that we need to read. I'm 
we will we will read those. Let me put these rip sheets and threads in here. The duct tape. Oh, there's no room. We're gonna have to move some of this stuff. Uh, it's probably the floating uh, trailer counter. It's causing some problems. The rip sheets weigh six point three five. Thread and twine and stuff. Two sheet ropes. I only have room for one. There's a... Um, Put that on the ground. It looks awesome. Come on, how good does that look? Is Jefferson's deck bigger yet? It's getting there. It's not. It's not as big as uh, I'd like it, but it's it's close. It is close. How's this generator looking? 25% fuel? Just running like a madman? Read some magazines. We'll have three new dances when we're all done. Red, 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 red. All right, it's more chilly. We're gaining weight, which is good. We want to gain some weight. Uh, let's see what the weather's doing tomorrow. sled yet. Uh, we need to find a plan another uh, industrial area we can go to. I mean, we might have to take a road trip somewhere. Okay, it's going to rain tomorrow night. Order 176 has been issued? What does that mean? Let's 
gonna be raining tomorrow morning, but it should uh, it should clear up. Okay, so we've been to here and we found the antique oven. We didn't go into the admin building because there's not much point, but we checked these. We did not check the auto mechanic here. There's a diner and then there's a, I don't know, you can't see it from the road. I've never really bothered to check. If we keep going down here, we could turn down here and go to March Ridge, which is apparently, there's quite a population of zombies in March Ridge, but there is a video store. Up here, if we keep going north, it eventually turns off. There's an area over here where there's an army surplus. We could always go over there and have a look, see if we can find some stuff. Might be good. And then there's a bunch of like farmhouses with uh, sheds on the way back. Maybe we could get lucky and get uh, some stuff that we need. I don't think there's any sledgehammers at the prison. I could be wrong though. We need to read farming one. Okay, here comes the rain. Go to bed at about 11.30 or so. Actually, let's... Let's go to bed now. I heard one gunshot during the night. Gosh, we were tired. It is 9.10. We were so tired. Alright, we haven't had any visitors for a couple evenings now, it feels like. Which is good. Uh, how's our weight doing? 79 and rising. So we need something that is going to... Fill us up. I think I burnt it. It is totally burnt. Okay. My bad. I didn't realize they cook so fast. Holy shit. Okay, we, we basically don't have any fresh food anymore, so... We can switch this thing off. Oh, actually, what am I doing? I need the oven. I'm going to make some soups. Painted water. Okay, cooking. We can make some shortbread cookie dough. We can prepare soup. Um, ideally we want to prepare soup with some, um, mushroom soup. Or not. Yeah. 
Yes. Let's get some butter in there. Crackers? Mmm. Dried kidney beans? Mmm. Let's put some corn in here before it goes bad. That's, that's going to be a soup to be proud of, right? Mushroom, bean, and corn soup. We can make two bowls. drink half of one of these. There, we want to get rid of the moodlet, but at the same time, we don't really want to um, put on a ton of weight either. Okay. We'll keep the generator on then. We might as well. Farming one. TV dinner burnt. Okay, I'll go drop some of this stuff. Have a smoke. We might find some food uh, if we head over to the uh, to the thing too, right? A bit late, but I mean, we can go have a look, I suppose. Is anyone down here? Doesn't look like it. I think we have enough fuel. I mean, we could fuel up. Um, where did all the little, um, where did my, um, hey, where's the HUD? <laughs> what did I press? And don't say Q. Q, Q. V. Press V a few times. I lost it. Oh, do you think I pressed it like... There we go. Thank you! Alright. We're heading to a new destination. One I've never been to before. I don't know if it'll be busy over there or not. I also brought my book with me, I guess, in case we uh, get stuck overnight. I just threw a can out my window. 
I love that. I love that I just did that. Just driving down the road, chucking a tin can out the out the window. Listening to that. Listen to that iconic sound of an empty tin can bouncing down the road. I think at the military surplus we might be able to find a big backpack. If we're lucky. And if we're really lucky, can you imagine finding, I don't know, a little sledgehammer, perchance, per perhaps? I think there's a gas station over here too. It's a little bit of a trek though. It's a little bit of a trek and there's just nothing up here. Look, there's like no zombies, nothing. Just me, the road, and my bouncing empty tin can. Let's tune in and see what the deal is. Oh, here we go. We got a turn coming up. All right. So, where we want to go is we want to go straight here. There's another like turning off bit, but we're going to go straight through, which takes us into like uh, some like little country roads. Hopefully, we can find some food. I think there's a little market. Might be like some tinned food that we could pick up. Actually, we could we could do with stocking up on some tin food. There's still all of the houses in uh, Rosewood to uh, pilfer for food and other stuff as well, right? There's a couple of houses down there. Is that a shovel? Yeah, it looks like a shovel. It's like a road crew here. Three toolboxes here. They got a roadblock, duct tape, you name it. These guys were out here and they were working. They had their ear protection on and everything. I've done it again. <laughs> it's not my fault. Some more houses. Farmhouses. Might be worth checking those maybe on the way back if it's... Whoa. Because uh, if they have sheds. There's another house here. You could get some, uh, some backup generators. Like all sorts, right? Whoa. Yeah. 
If they have um, bulletproof vests, I don't want to uh, ruin them. They did not, though. But we can always check the back of their car. They might have some good ones in there. Good to have a couple spare, huh? You get a bullet bandolier, though. Turn the sirens on right now. Guess another house down there. No mailbox, though, so maybe that's just like more like farm storage or something. Okay, it's getting a little bit busy around here, but we are approaching some points of interest. There is a, I think, a gas station in here somewhere. It's right here. No generator for it, but it's probably full of snacks and stuff for hungry. It's like a post van. There's a laundromat. I don't know what that is. It's like a, a vehicle workshop. Let's see what's up here. I'm not super familiar with this area. Ah, what's this? Ah, here we go. It's a food market. Probably want to go check in there. It's quite busy around here. Very busy. Ah, there's a trailer. Nice. And here's the army surplus. It's a little it's a little busy. Let's try to pull some of them like down to here and then maybe loop back around and lose some of them. Fat chance of that happening, I guess. Whoa. Nice. Getting a bit exerted. These watches going off. Just gonna smoke in my car for a sec.
Just chugging a two liter bottle of Fanta here. Wow, look at this place. What's a boonie hat? There's a balaclava, ear protectors. There's a military t-shirt. Nice. There's a military green camo jacket. Which gives us some good protection. Let's grab a poncho. Never had a poncho before. Camel pants, short. There's t shirts, shirts, shorts. Holy crap. They got some dresses over here, it looks like. They got a survival vest. Standard issue survival vest for military pilots. Expanded helicopter events. With a capacity of three? Neat. I got a couple of these actually. Jackets. Camo shirt. Camo pants. Camo pants are less protection than what I have now. There's an army baseball cap. Signal flare. Signal flare is uh, part of the helicopter events thing too, right? Hiking bag, matches, some rope, it's tents, earmuffs, padded pants and scarves. I got padded pants and scarves at home. Good to know, though, just in case we need some more. Boots, long johns, like a bunch of like winter stuff, which, you know, that's fine. There's a duffel bag. Oh, large backpack. This is the one, right? Capacity for 27. Okay, great. Let me put some of this stuff into my backpack. The hammer, for example. Signal flare. All right, they got a, a ham radio. There is a huge area back here that I don't think I can access. I'm taking a stretcher bed. I feel like I want one. And I'm also going to take, I'm liberating the USA flag as well. No way am I leaving it here. It's locked. There's no way I'm leaving the Star Spangled Banner in the clutches of the enemy, right? I just couldn't live with myself. Let's smoke while we're back here too. No, I don't have a sledgehammer with me. I haven't found one yet. Okay, let's fill up our bottles from the toilet.
How, uh, oh, you need a sledgehammer to get into this back room, unless you've confined the key. Uh, one of those corpses outside might have the, there's some keys on the, oh, that's not keys, is it? Hello? Do any of you have a key? Disposable camera. Guess they were doing some sightseeing around here. No key on these guys. No. We're looking probably for somebody wearing some military clothes, right? Who is possibly the store owner who could possibly have had the keys hand fork uh, we might just need to come back at some point with um, a sledgehammer and get get through that way right you can dismantle closed doors which with with what just deconstruct the door isn't the alarm going to go off though The alarm's gonna go off though, is it not? And then I'm dead? There's a 70% chance that I do it. Alright, let's try. Hey, it's fine. We did it. This is where all the good stuff is, right? The back. It's just, it's loads of ammo. I mean, yeah, I could... Oh, there's a military helmet here, though. Oh, that is so cool. Look at me now. I don't have to wear the stupid firefighter helmet anymore. That's great. I could sell that to Prapor. Yes, exactly. What's all this? Loads of ammo. And guns. Oh my god, there's so many guns. I feel like uh, we need, we'll need. we come back for this stuff though, right? Like, There's no way I'm going to be using any of this stuff anytime soon. I wouldn't have thought. And th then when we do need to, we'll come back here, right? We know it's all here. Can you actually snipe in this game? Surely I want the choke tube. Do I want the choke tube? It's for a shotgun. Provides a wider blast but decreased damage. Don't know if I actually do want... It. There's so many attachments and stuff. Holy crap. There's a laser? Yeah, Jefferson is tired. We're going to have to um, make a move. Jefferson's tired as hell, but god damn, he, he doesn't look the part. It's getting dark out there, too. It's 9 o'clock. We should make a, make a move.
I thought there might be like some survival snacks and stuff in here, but there are none. Like some granola bars or something. Boom. We're a bit tired, but we could get this trailer. again. Okay, look, I've got just the thing. I'm going to eat some coffee. I'm going to eat half of my supply of coffee just in case. Just in case we need to tussle with some people. That attached the right one. Nope. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well. Ah. Well. <laughs> oh my God, man. Well. There's no fucking way. <laughs> oh, why is that interface so bad? Oh, why? That fucking really sucks. Oh, I did not get the trailer. It attached back to the other thing. Oh, man. God, that ended very quickly. <laughs> That's a very sudden death, yeah. Well, yeah, we didn't get the sledgehammer, and honestly, the the uh, the house with the deck base wasn't the greatest, really, either, was it? <laughs> oh, fudge. Fudge. I thought it was attached to the uh, to our truck. We could have uh, we could have made a hasty escape, but uh, the noise of the truck. I guess there's some cars louder than others, because that was an almighty amount of uh, of zombies that came after us. Oh, reversing is loud too. Jefferson Wilbur, dead. He's gone. He's dead and gone. Oh, man, okay. Right. Survival challenge rules. The same, the very same. And we want to load up uh, Rosewood Lumberjack, which is what we had last time. So we got... Uh, this, was a, this was actually nice, all this, right? Outdoorsman, Dexter, Speed Demon... Slow reader, short-sighted, weak stomach, smoker, prone to illness, fear of blood, underweight, slow healer, and high thirst. 
it even evens out perfectly. We can't play in a different city. No, I don't know any of the other ones. I'm, I'm, I finally know Rosewood now. You were gone two minutes. I know. God, we made it to the military surplus, and uh, and we we got a cool helmet and everything, and then I just got greedy trying to get that trailer. I should have just left. I should have just left. But what can you do, eh? All right. We random once every time. Rashad Howe. With a tank top, denim shirt, McCoy's t-shirt, baggy jeans, long so socks, and sneakers. Okay. Yeah, the deck. The deck is gone once again. Peace be with you, Rashad. I can't believe that's how Jefferson died. He absolutely got swarmed. He had a lot of kills. I didn't see how many kills he actually had in the end, but... He had quite a few, didn't he? I don't want to eat a whole broccoli because what if I just start farting and uh, and I give my uh, give my location away? You know, how awful would that be? Okay, I know where we are. We're close to the fire station. If we want to head up there and grab some axes. I mean, we could try to secure the fire station. The fire station base is pretty good that one time, but then we had a, a bit of a curse time with it as well, didn't we? There was nothing in that house, holy crap. Make a base there for the tenth time? Okay, well, listen, we've only done it twice, and uh, the second time, uh, the helicopter event completely dominated us. Fire station or deck every time? I don't really know where else. Well, we had the gas station uh, base, the, the Rosewood gas station, that one time. We've, we've based out of the farmhouse, like, dozens of times. Yeah, the, the, the garage in the, uh, in the firehouse is nice, you're right. Time to try the southern lake houses. I don't even know how to get there, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We got firefighter pants and military boots straight away. There's not as many axes here as there was uh, last time. This crowbar is almost dead. Jesus. Hey, how did you guys get in here? <laughs> See, you're stuck in there now. Let's see if I can get this fireman helmet.
Oh, there's a fair few zombies randomly out in this field. I think we're dead. I think I've bitten off more than I can chew here. I got an idea. This is not the end of Rashad's journey. <laughs> Okay, good. They can't follow me. Uh-oh. Hey, what are you guys doing here? I could fill my empty uh, red mug. Still no can opener. I don't know what time it is either. Let's see if any of these guys have a watch on them. Yeah. Okay, it's 11.40. So a whole bunch of tapes here. There's a Hunter Magazine, Volume 3. Oh my gosh. Howdy, neighbors. Grief. That one was considering lunging for sir. Oh man, I got Jefferson.txt is <laughs> is now obsolete. I can't believe this has happened. After all that meticulous planning, I never learn. If only I'd learn.
If only. Oh my god. They got a car zone? True dancing? I have to come back here. Oh, we need some smokes. Church base? Oh, I don't know if we can do a church base. I think it's I think it's like probably too hard to uh defend the church. God, these are some small ass backyards. Not everyone has a mansion. True, true. That's true. freaking out here. Zombies to the left, zombies to the right. to eat a, an entire fresh yogurt. Hi, do you have smokes? Where are your can openers? This meat. Look at all this ham. Look at all these cakes. Some chocolate bread. God, we can fatten up on this stuff for sure, right? Look at all this pie. Nice. Alright, we'll come back here. No smokes. Oh, shit. Give them the slip. They'll never know. Okay, we're a bit hot from exerting ourselves. A little bit of exertion.
We're a tiny bit sweaty. I wanted to go in there, but that pack of zombies is large. Whoa. Try wilderness run, get an axe and go deep in the forest. Man, I am too scared of the forest. There's too many zombies in the forest. I'd be just crapping my pants the whole time. <laughs> Free fertilizer, yeah. Just what I need. Let's check around back. Oh my god. That is so many smokes. Padded pants on the floor. And a formal shirt. No, no can opener. But at least we got some smokes. Okay, no, um, no emergency broadcast station on that one. Or this one. See if they have any good tapes. They don't. See if they have any good magazines. Not really. Let's see if we can get into this car. key for it though. Oh gosh. Jefferson nearly had 800 kills. Wow. That's a lot of kills. 
some more SIGs here. <laughs> more SIGs? Holy crap. I'll take them. I'm acting like a real dehydrated meat stick. <laughs> I feel like one. I should I should hydrate. I'm going to head to this uh, farmhouse. See if we can uh, have some luck there. Deputy? Oh my god. Maybe this is not the best move? There are a lot of zombies on the way up here. Okay. It's not very safe in here, granted. Because of these uh, windows and stuff at the bottom.
Jesus. Alright, well, the upstairs is clear for now. See if there's anything in the kitchen. There's a kitchen knife. There's a couple of cigarettes. Two cigarettes. Oh my god. This house. What the hell? There's, uh, there's nothing here. Psst. Hey. Hey, Melon Nose. So many office supplies out here. Oh, there's another axe here, though. Oh, that's good. Oh, there's nothing in here. <laughs> there's nothing in here. There's a sledge. Are you serious? There was not. Oh! There is- <laughs> Oh my god! How did I miss that? Oh! Wow! That's amazing! Well, we can knock out the stairs up, up there already! You never liked Jefferson. Think of the deck we can build out here, chat. Jesus. That's great. I love a deck, yeah. Are we living in the shed again? No, we can live in the house. We'll knock the uh, the stairs out. Live upstairs. It's not a... Uh, it's not a, a, a crazy uh, populated place over here. We can just slowly clear it out over time. It should be fine. I do need a nail, though. I have a hammer, though. All right, got a nail.
<laughs> my god, man. That is so good. Hey, I need some more nails. I need a saw as well. disassemble this bed. The crate. Okay, well, I, we're safe here tonight. I just need... Um, Actually, no, I don't even need food. We're exerted. Uh, we can smoke. We're over encumbered. I think there might have been a saw in the shed. Yeah, we'll go out and check. Oh, we don't even have to sleep with the doors closed or anything. There's no stairs. There's no way up. They can't do it. The only thing is, is if they eat our one sheet rope, it's a, it's a long drop down. <laughs> oh, that's the only thing. Also didn't bring the, uh, the TV up. Which, uh, could be an, could be an issue. All right, our sheet rope is still there. Just grab one for when we get out of here. Let's eat all this. No, I don't have any more nails. If I get a saw, I can start disassembling stuff and get some more uh, nails that way, but... I need another sheet rope, right? Need two. Oh, maybe three? Or maybe I lost my nail? I'm stuck up here. I did lose the nail. Ah, come on. <laughs> I'm stuck up here. <laughs> I'm going to break my legs. Oh, I can't get back up. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I can never get back up. Shit, we're gonna have to find another house. Or build stairs up here. I don't think there's anything else up here that I can disassemble, right? Yeah, I disassembled all the furniture, yeah. Yeah, I need a saw for that. Blue plastic chair is... 
Mask and torch. Doors you need a saw for as well. Oh no, I need a screwdriver actually. I don't think there's one up here. Well, we're not going to use it anyway, right? Oh, okay. Right, well, we could do it, but we're just going to have to sleep on the floor until I can get a cot or something up here. <laughs> Two nails! Wow, okay, good. We could, It's still possible. Rashad is kind of a dummy. Okay, chat, listen. Think, uh, Dwell on that one for a bit about how much of a dummy he is. I agree, he is one. Uh, we're off to a, I want to say great start. I'd say it's more of an interesting start. Um, but listen, I got to go and uh, take a quick break. So I'll do that and uh, I'll be right back and we'll carry on with uh, run number 12, uh, Rashad. Okay, see you in a sec.
<clears throat> Sorry, I'm back. I'm back. Oh my god, I can't believe um, what happened uh, this morning, and I also can't believe what's happening right now to Rashad Howe. All right, we need to go find a saw, um, and we need to dump some uh, some stuff as well, right? Some of the stuff that we might want to use. What do I have on me that's so heavy? The sledgehammer? Oh my god, man. we got to carry it around with us, right? There's no way we can lose this thing. Okay, let's eat these cakes because we need to put on some weight anyway. This will get us going big time. This will get us gaining. No, it has not. <laughs> it's not even. It's not even made a dent. Well, it just shows. If you want to eat cakes all day long, you probably can because look, he's not even gaining. Well, he's at seventy, but we got uh, we got some ways to, uh, ways to go, right? Okay. Um, Let's put these maps, let's put this in here. This does not need to be carried around. This can go in here too. We need a backpack of some description. Duct tape, an empty bowl, sure. This is all stuff that we will need eventually, but we don't need right now. Um, we wanna take this, uh, we don't wanna take these, and we should be good, okay. Pray for me. Wrong button. I got tea. I did get tea. I've come back with tea. All right, we have to defend this sheet rope with our life for a little while at least. Yeah, sorry, I did uh, I did come back with some uh, with some tea. Oh, look, there's log piles on the side there too. Okay, let's see if there's a saw in here. There might have been one, I can't remember. If not, we'll have to go look for one. There's a wrench. There's a mechanics volume two. Um, yeah, there's a saw. Okay, good. We'll grab this. Let's grab this uh, ax. A garden hoe. A wood mallet. This is all good stuff. We'll take it. Okay, and let's um, grab these sheets too. Good. Seems pretty quiet around here. Nice. Oh, it's so nice not having to worry about um, anyone sneaking up on us, huh? Got the sledgehammer too. We can knock through some of these load-bearing walls. Let's add some sheets to here so that we can have... Um, Screws. Okay. Oh, this door we need a screwdriver for. For doors. Okay. Fine. Um, but we can disassemble this. We're going to have to bring the TV up. We don't want to miss too many um, of our shows, right? Okay. Let's put this book in here, this wrench, this wood mallet, this garden hoe. These tapes can go in here too. Sheet rope, don't need this for now. We'll drop all the scrap wood downstairs, right? Makes sense. Good to have some storage though, it's nice. Okay, let's fill our water bottles. Very good. And is there anything else to disassemble up here? I don't think so.
All right, one thing we will need to do is... <laughs> oh, I don't have the right... Okay, we're going to sleep in this dumb chair. Until we get a bed. Such a dumb chair. So we can get the couch up here, and then we'll try to get a bed. Whoops. That chair's trying its best. I know, but... You know? Okay. Let's pick up this uh, TV. And this light low table um sure All right. <clears throat> Life and living. Let's tune in. Show's going to be on pretty soon. We don't want to miss any shows. We want to get as many skill ups as we can. Hopefully with modifiers, but the uh, the book situation down here is non-existent, unfortunately. Um, can I pick up this? There's a strong chance it breaks. <laughs> There's a strong chance that it breaks. <laughs> Whoops. Hello, is anyone in here? No. I can hear somebody outside. Or in here? can't move this upstairs either. Oh yeah, here. Looks like we got some some big company coming through. Hey. Woodcraft. Bang, bang. Woodcraft. All right, carpentry one. Nice. I'm still, um, I'm still going to carry this around with me, right? Just in case uh, I'm, uh, I get stuck without it. It could happen, you never know. Oh yeah, I meant to drop the scrap wood uh, downstairs.
I, I w and I will drop it downstairs. Okay, axe, sledgehammer, axe, saw will carry with us. Hammer will carry with us. Um, fine. We'll start a collection of uh, watches here too, right? Okay, we can't put a sheet on that window, sadly. Or we could actually. Because now that there's no, we could build floor there, right? Maybe we should. Is that most of the windows up here covered except for that one? And I have a sheet for it. Looks like it. Bong, 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 bong. Yeah, it's the housing authority again. I can't believe it. Just when you think. Might just be safer to take this stuff upstairs and disassemble it. Can I have like a wood shop in here. <laughs> Yeah. Anybody out here? No. Okay, good. All right. We'll have a uh, escape rope on the other side of the house too, right? And then maybe on this side too. Makes sense. Use our nails for escape ropes. Yeah, just in case one uh, goes, then we've got some backups, right? Be good. Okay, I need a screwdriver. We'll have to go um, on an adventure. I'm hungry as well. Having some wheels would be really nice. Need a backpack, yeah. Hopefully I can make it to these houses before the uh, the six o'clock show. That'd be good.
Let's just fast walk. Because it's going to take forever. <laughs> okay, we made it. That's how you walk? I wish I walked like that. Oh, we got plenty of time for the next show. Oh, shit. Oh, that's so sad, isn't it? When one of your one of your regular places is burnt down. Look at that. Let's just salvage what we can from it. Yeah, the TV survived. Yeah, it's an antique TV, though. I don't really want it. If we, I mean, I guess we could go watch TV there tonight. Well, we got a barbecue for our new deck. That'll be fun. Nothing here. Um, let's see, device options. Ah, great. We got the uh we got the emergency uh, broadcast. Uh, the emergency broadcast is 89.6 this time. Yeah, 89.6. And it looks like uh, we got a couple of books here too that we can take. We are very uh, overburdened, but it's fine. Oh my god, man. Okay, we can eat, finally. Might have to come back for the... Um, barbecue. Uh, unless we just take it. Uh, doesn't matter. Okay, no screwdriver here, though. I don't know if we're going to make it back for the show. But it's probably more important to get back, isn't it? We, we, we got a, a chair that we're going to sleep on for now. It doesn't, it doesn't help that I've got like a sledgehammer and a bunch of furniture on me as well. Nah, we're going to miss the shows. It's fine. It's fine to miss the shows as long as we get back in one piece. We'll make sure that we get them uh, tomorrow morning. could actually get killed by these guys if they see me. They've seen me. Fuck. Oh. Where's the barbecue? Oh god. Oh 
Oh god. Faster. Nah, I'm dead. Okay, remind me that the uh, barbecue is out here. We'll have to come pick it up. I'm defending the barbecue with my life. Don't worry. We'll come and pick it up when we're when we have less of a load. It's gone from holy crap. We're 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 thriving and surviving out here to holy crap, I'm almost dead. Yeah, we still got a little ways to go before we get back as well. That is really unfortunate. Such a large group moved into this area. I'm just going to sneak back. My sheet rope? Sheet rope one is intact. Good. Good. Right. We're not in a mad rush to get the barbecue just yet, so... It, it'll be fine out there for a bit. It, the main thing is, now... We're safe, right? That is the main thing. Whew. Okay, that's close. Let's eat these chips. All right, and... We can place this radio. We need a little table. We need to set up a nice little den. Device options. All right. So we got a couple of books. Farm, farming Volume 1, we can actually read. Okay, I think the sledgehammer we can put away for now. We're not going to use it for a little while. And then let's put these earbuds in here. And all this cooking stuff can go in here too. We'll start, hopefully, making a, um, a, a barbecue... area that's safe and then we can uh we can let the cooking begin nice well, we should probably wash ourselves too what an what a nice non-dumb chair it is it's dumb one of the dumbest I have so many regrets around this chair, you know? Okay, uh, let's make sure that we don't miss... We never want to miss um, the morning cartoons, right? So let's go for 550. Okay. 
All right. It's not going to be the most comfortable sleep ever. Basically have to sleep upright in a chair, but at least it's safe. We're safe here. Nice. Okay. It's raining out. So we got the cooking show. Don't want to miss Woodcraft at noon. It's really coming down. Maybe we should just stay put today. Read this farming book. No, it's coming down again. Okay, we're getting carpentry skill ups. Yeah. Okay, we almost got carpentry too. It's pretty good. Getting a little bit hungry. We got a can of beans that we can have. Great. Right. Um, so this book is done. Farming volume one. How's the tea treating me? Great. Perfect. I made a bowl of beans. Well, I'm eating it cold, but at least I'm eating it out of a bowl. A bowl that I am not going to wash. Gross. That's gross. The water's off already? Hello? <laughs> it's day two! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh. That is really unlucky. Holy crap. In some ways, very lucky, and then in other ways, really unlucky. Jesus Christ. Okay, I can't take that up. Hopefully there's no company here. to get another nail and one plank of wood. I'll take it. It's better than nothing. Hello, what attracted you here? Nice, uh, bad condition leather jacket. My fault, actually, that it's in bad condition. 
because of the brutal slaying. Okay, that's the last of the furniture that I can take with me until we get um, better carpentry skills. This kitchen has been completely pilfered. I can't believe that the water's off already. That's brutal. Day two water switch off. I don't think we've ever had that before. Okay, we've got two planks. We need another nail and carpentry too. Oh, we're just in time for the uh, evening shows. We're going to have to make a trip into town to go to the gas station at least. Um, there's nothing else to read, is there? There's Car Zone, but we don't really want to watch Car Zone until we got Mechanics Volume 1 read. I don't think we have any other Volume 1s, do we? No. We don't want to start disassembling stuff because we don't have the modifier for electrics either. We're a little bit tired. Let's go to bed. Uh, before we go to bed, let's just see what the um, what's happening uh, tomorrow. Expecting showers or heavy rain. That's tonight, apparently. Tomorrow, it's going to be 22. Maximum of 27 with some clouds. Thick fog. Oh. Showers and heavy rain in the evening. Oh, thick fog. Oh, man, that stinks. Yeah, it's a bad, it's going to be a bad day tomorrow. Very foggy day. All right, it hasn't started just yet, though. Do, 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 yabba dabba do. Just make sure that I've got everything out of this shed.
Yeah, I think I got everything. There's a bunch of wrenches in here. There's a leaf rake. I mean, we have an axe. We could chop some wood and then saw it into planks, but I lack nails. There's, uh, there's also Operation Rescue the Barbecue. You got 20 nails. Oh my god, you're so lucky. I wish I had that many nails. I'm going to put all my scrap wood just in here for now. I know it's going to be foggy, but we're heading over to the gas station. We're going to run out of food. Shit, i got to go watch my shows. I don't want to miss this. smoke before the oh the fog is set in already we can't go out in this right like it's just you, we cannot i have no food though there's no food in this in this whole house i've eaten it all and the water's off too we could sit at home and watch true dancing episode 25 there is some tomato paste as well at a push at a push, we could have the tomato paste. I locked myself into the junk room. This is a, this is a dangerous mission, but I think we I mean even if we just clear zombies from around uh around the house, we got to do something. Yeah, might be a good time to go back for the barbecue, yeah. Yeah, 
This is where I regret not setting up the base close to the town. Yeah. I mean, we could just do the, exactly what we've done here at the gas station, because I can knock out the stairs. We would just have to secure the, uh, the sheet ropes, right? And I have enough nails. And then at least we're closer to everything. And then we'd be right on top of fuel, too. Oh, <gasps> look, maybe we've died. We've died and we're on like some sort of insane. Plane, you know, we were dead. Yes, thank you. Who knows, maybe one of these guys will just have a screwdriver stuck in them. Can happen. Look, this guy's got one, I can't believe it. joking he doesn't yeah I feel like Rashad has traveled to the spirit realm on this day we're in the in the realm of spirits guys drop some glasses. I'm sure I saw some. Yeah, there. There's a screwdriver. Or is it a letter opener? It's a fork. Let's see if it's a little less busy in the back way. There's a satchel here. Good. Better than nothing. He's got a hand fork in him. I don't want to eat that stale cheese sandwich. I see an axe. I see a hand axe. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I'm moving in to intercept. Come to papa. That was a free sandwich. Hey, that was a, that was a free ticket to the loony bin. You see how much unhappiness you get from eating a stale cheese sandwich? 
No thanks. No thanks. This bulletproof vest is, uh, I think it's got one hole in it. <clears throat> it's not so bad. I fired a gun uh, in uh, Marge's run when uh, we got bitten. We went back with a shotgun and caused a ruckus, but um, that's the only time. I have ne I've never uh, gotten far enough to where we could comfortably just shoot a lot, you know? There's a lot of drinks here. Where's all the food at? Here we go. Yeah. Okay, empty gas cans and stuff we're not too worried about just yet. Oh my god, do we ever have so many cigarettes. Any plonkies? I didn't see any plonkies. Good. Okay. Um carrying so much stuff. Let's just eat. take those watches 
We get to get some uh, some fanny packs to put all of our uh, all of our stuff in, right? That'd be nice. There's a bandage in here. That's about it. I just ate a grapefruit solo. Yeah, the whole thing. Yeah, I did. don't want to lose more weight. We don't want to miss woodcraft either. We'll try to make it over to the uh, mechanic uh, place. There'll be a screwdriver there for sure, right? Is red licorice even licorice? I think so. Alright, carpentry too, nice. We'll be able to move the couch up to our room now. God, this is such a cursed run. Next time, beds. Boom. Beds. Okay, we're on the up now. 69 and rising. Good. Yeah, it's pouring, but we can make it over to the mechanic shop, I, I believe. Let's see what's over there. don't know if the blood will wash off of me in the rain. That would be good if it did. There's a couple of um, quite rude dudes in my way. There's a bit of a pack of them here. A bit scared, but it's fine. Yeah, good. Mission accomplished. And then some. Holy crap, there's so many in here.
Now we can try to find a car. Yeah. I don't think there was anything parked out here. There's, um... There wasn't even that many in that parking lot, was there? Start my big watch collection. Well, at least we got like a little bag. It's not so bad. There's no key for this thing, unfortunately. Fuck, that would have been great. Get a van. Are those keys? Or is it just garbage on the ground? It's just some garbage. How good would that have been? Sledgehammer and deck over the uh, the gas pumps. That could be cool, yeah. All right, our exertion levels are quite high. Probably a good time to head back. We're getting tired as well. Fuck it, let's sleep here tonight. We got food and stuff. It's reasonably safe. It's not that safe, is it? It's got stairs. I think let's just go home. We've been busy today. We got 109 kills already. With our axe. And it's still in great condition. Holy shit. You're catching up on VODs and you just saw the loss of Howard? I hate to break it to you, you're in for a lot of heartache if you're watching all the VODs. <laughs> it doesn't get any better. It's just heartache after heartache after heartache. Alright, well we managed to catch woodcraft today, which is good. We'll manage to hopefully make it back in time for the survival shows at 6 and watch cooking in the morning. Check the weather forecast. We got the screwdriver so we can start taking apart the doors. It's a shame we don't have the uh, XP modifier for um, carpentry, but 
We can only do what we can do, I guess, eh? No, the forecast was uh, heavy fog, but it was only very foggy this morning. I mean, it lifted. I hope nobody ate my rope. Nobody ate my rope. Damn. Okay. Whew. We made it. We're in a bit of a state. What can you do though? Okay. Put all these in here. Let's get these garbage bags in here. We have a hand axe that we can attach to our belt left as a backup in case uh, we're out and we lose this one. Water bottles. We'll need them. The water's cut off. That's better. Nice. Okay. Am I going to build a magical freestanding deck again with a sheet rope to dangle down and you can survive a bit longer this time? Probably, yeah. I mean, we'll need some... I don't think we need as big of a deck this time out here, but we'll we'll definitely want some... some, uh, some platform above the house, yeah. So that we can uh, plant some uh, crops and stuff. Some little, some, a little bit of deckage. Maybe not as much as we've had previously, though. Okay. much luck with these doors either. There we go. Okay, two planks. Pretty good. Alright, let's watch this show. next time that did not give us any skill ups in anything what the heck what the heck not even one one damn thing
There's a 60% chance it breaks. <laughs> Whoopsies. There's a 60% chance that this oak counter breaks as well. We got it! <laughs> oh my god! We can start making a kitchen upstairs! A kitchen to be proud of! Wow. VHS Big Milker 7? If only. I would love that. Love to. I would love to watch some Big Milker 7 right now. Man, that would be good. We could take a... We could take our sledgehammer to the uh, fire station. <laughs> <laughs> Get our sheet ropes. We could uh, we could make it really safe. Get some sheet ropes. We could take our sledgehammer to the um, we could take our sledgehammer to our favorite house and build the deck again. You need to get the car first. gas station better yeah they got the big coolers and then you're right you're right by the uh we'd have to make a wall around the pumps though right and the wall around the pumps would get attacked like all the time not the cursed home again you're begging could use the construction site yeah we'd need to have a higher level of carpentry though right for the uh, well, actually, no, because the gate... Well, last time we went there, if you remember, it was absolutely filled with zombies, and they'd knock the gate down, which was annoying. Always find somewhere new. Yeah, I don't know where we could go. I mean, in, in Rosewood, I feel like... I mean, we could p potentially live on the roof of the school. It's quite big. And then just have a whole bunch of uh, rope accesses. I mean, you could board up the uh, the backyard, jump over the fence, and then have a bunch of rope accesses at the back, right? Use the motel and destroy the stairs. There's all the cabins by the southern gas station. With the lake? I don't know if I've ever been there. Is there a lake over there? Cabins and uh, a lake? Build a cabin in the woods near Muldraw. The gas station... We lived in the gas station last time and it was... It was pretty handy. Um, I mean, now that we have the sledgehammer, it's easy enough to just knock the stairs out and then it'd be safe up there. It's quite small up there, though. There's not that much. I suppose the nice thing is, though, is that there's... Well, do you know what, though? The thing that sucks about all of these places, including this one, is that uh, we ideally you want somewhere, I think, that has a, a third level. Whether it be like an outdoor roof or, yeah, 
like like a third level, like a, like an outdoor roof, like uh, probably the like the admin building. Um, no, no, that hasn't that has an outdoor roof, but it's only one level, right? It's ground floor and then up onto the roof. What has what has a ground floor, first floor, and then roof access? No, not the grocery store. I don't think you can get onto the roof of the grocery store. The Louisville Mall and the prison. Okay, well, both of those places are insane. Like, there's uh, like the most of the, the population of zombies are concentrated in those locations. No, the fire station doesn't have uh, roof access though. It has a, it has a uh, a first floor, but it doesn't have any access up above it. Well, you can build stairs up too, but you need carpentry six to build stairs. And they're expensive to build as well. What's in the courthouse? Courtrooms. The grocery store comes with a pre-made door that goes to the empty roof? Okay, so walk me through that then. The grocery store has the ground floor with all the grocery uh, stuff, the shelves and everything. You walk up the stairs and then you're in like the office area. And then there's another set of stairs that you can go up to the roof with. The reason, uh, the reason why we need uh, another set of stairs is to put... Um, Barrels, rain catchers, so that we can plumb them, plumb them into the our living level, right? Because the the problem we've had with all of our bases is that we 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 haven't been able to plumb barrels. It's much easier to use plumbed sinks than it is to just use the tainted barrels, right? There's no more stairs. The roof is the same level as the admin area. Yeah, so it's no good then. I don't think there is anywhere in Rosewood. I think you're right. Except for the prison, maybe. I think the prison um, has two levels and then a, and then roof access, right? You're doing great, Dad. There's no three, four floor places in Rosewood. Right. So we'd have to go and... Um, Explore a new town, potentially. Okay, let's get this bad boy turned on so we can listen to the news. The, the weather report as well as watch the, uh, the TV show. I can't concentrate on two things at once. Now I love a BLT. Okay, clear skies today. This is good. Oh, light fog. Okay, light fog is not so bad. Or is that tomorrow? Oh, it must be tomorrow. Okay. It's light fog tomorrow. I didn't even see what it was today. Do 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 do. All right, good. Gonna eat all these canned peaches. Uh, 
Um, and I'm, on, I'm gonna open this uh, canned potato and eat all this too. Because I'm crazy. I know there's a warehouse in Muldraw, yeah, with the with the access, yeah. I know the one. I was just trying to think if there's anywhere closer closer to home. All right, let's head out. Let's head out. Let's make hay while the sun shines, and uh, let's see if we can get a car today. It would be nice. It would open things up a little bit for us to potentially. The uh, warehouse is um, the the uh, the warehouses that we go to try to get a sledgehammer and stuff from near Muldraw. There wasn't any three-story things there either, right? It's kind of out in the middle of nowhere, but that all could also work too, right? You don't need to be. It might be nice to be in between a couple of places rather than just in somewhere, you know. So we, I think we're, I think we're happy with the looting of the gas station and probably with the um, mechanics place too, right? We can head further in. Really need to get some books. Would be really nice. Watching me play is frustrating, and it makes you want to play, and then you play and you fail. Yeah, it's, it's one of those, isn't it? I watch, um, I watch professional sports from time to time, and it's the same thing. I see Ronaldo miss a bicycle kick, and I'm swearing and cursing, saying, you idiot, how could you do that? And then I go to do a bicycle kick when I'm playing football with my son, and um, cripple myself for six months. So there you go. It's the exact same. I am, I believe it or not, I'm, I am a professional gamer. It's how I earn my income. So it must mean that I'm professional. That I do it as a profession. Makes you a professional watcher. Wait, is that what you get paid to do? You get paid to watch me play games?
Remember those simpler times when uh, it was like such a big deal to just be able to clear from here to like the motel and stuff? And then I fluffed it. Now we're just out here going crazy. We don't even care. Just killing everything. Oh, the lock's broken. Interesting. I think this guy's got a screwdriver stuck in him. Does he? Or scissors? Ah, it's scissors. Okay. Alright. We don't need to go into these places because, well, they suck. But, getting a van would be good. Looks like there's some keys here. And the gas station is more or less clear, so we could. Oh. -ho. Okay, we'll have to kill a couple of guys in here, but it looks like we got a van. A van with just a tiny smidge of fuel. That's all we need. Just enough to get over here and do a big refuel. Here comes the fog. Why does this take so long to fill up? Holy crap. Okay, while we're here, let's grab a couple of gas cans too. Since we know there are some in here. Any ice cream? Nope. There's just a couple of gas cans. There's a fucking million empty gas cans in here. Just do one at a time because it's safer, right? Then I can actually check around a little. Make sure that nothing's sneaking up on us. Alright, we'll just fill up two for now. Holy... All right. This opens up a whole new world for us. A whole new world, don't you dare close your eyes. A new fantastic red van to you. No one to sorry girls know and where to go. I almost hit a light post. A brand new van, don't you dare drive my van. 
Oh shit! Oh god, <laughs> I forgot. I forgot about all the friends that I left behind here. <laughs> shit, there's a lot. I was gonna come back here and pick up some axes and whatnot, but uh, I don't know if I'm going to bother now. I forgot that we almost died at the start of this. Uh, started this run it was pretty it was pretty ropey what is with the fast the, the, what's the fascination with this place every time I come down here now it is loaded with zombies look at this why here I think it's because they know I like to come down here to, to build uh, my deck. To start building my deck. Sorry. It's pretty busy around here. Let's see what the school is like. There is a lot of vehicles at the school. That's uh, pretty busy down here. It usually is, though. There's usually quite a few zombies around here. We get down here to um, find a generator and stuff. I'm sure we'll find one in one of these garages. There's like a news van. Look at that. It's got all the satellite dishes on it and everything. It's cool. Quite busy, Rosewood, this time. Hey, look, my house. Somebody's somebody's parked their car at my house. Well, the cars in this parking lot. Wow. There's a lot of them back here too. I guess uh, I, I did have quite a few of them following me when I moved up here though, didn't I? Jeez. Let's go to that uh, army surplus store. I know it was pretty busy over there last time, but... See if we can get another backpack. That was great. Last time when we got that. I love an army surplus store. Yeah, me too. I love it. It was 89.6, right? I think it was 89.6 or was it 89.1? Oh yeah, no, it's right. Project Zomboid map. Project Zomboid map. Okay. 
Right, so I am on this. Okay, there is something up here. What is this place? Oh, it's a military base. Right. So there's a road that leads off. So north of the prison, there's a military base, <laughs> which <laughs> I don't think we really want to go to. Along the way towards, um, there's a couple of houses with some little sheds and stuff that look interesting. Oh, there's one here. It's just so out of the way, but it's got a little garage. It's like a little shed with a little garage next to kind of like it looks like a like a like a free range chicken yard and then the house. Um what else is out here? Farmhouse, farmhouse with a garage. Uh enclosed with a uh, fence but hoppable like zombie hoppable fences there's a house here with like a big um shed with no door and then it looks like a shed that has potentially a gun rack in it okay further along house with a shed with the garage the uh, the little shed garage combo it's kind of isolated, but it's pretty close to the military surplus and uh, everything around it as well. So further down from where we died, so there's a food market, which is where we died outside of. Uh, it looks like there's like a little medical center and uh, a clothing store that has nothing in it. It's just, it looks empty. That's close to army surplus. And then it looks like there's like a little bar restaurant. There's the gas station. There's some offices, county offices. There's a laundromat and a mechanic shop. I got 18 wikis open right now. Off the highway west of Riverside, large factory, three levels, roof access, separated garage access by second level bridge. Where is that? By Riverside. If we're going to be over here. Okay, so up here there is a small farmhouse with fields and tool shed. There's a little bit around it, but it's... Looks like there's a store and like a little diner. That's kind of north of the army surplus. There looks like a town that's not finished north of Riverside. It's got a baseball diamond and some some bigger buildings. It looks like there's a big school here with a, like a cafeteria, a huge library, but it looks like there's like plots for houses, but no houses. Small gas station, single pump. Oh, this is a big warehouse. It looks abandoned though. There's a construction yard. Actually, there's quite a bit of construction. Okay, I'm now looking at... Okay, this, this area is familiar to me. Uh, the area west, I think, of Riverside, to the west of Riverside. So it looks like some factory buildings. There's a couple of factory... One huge factory building and then one smaller factory building. There's the, the storage containers, storage container yard. We've been there before. There's Al's Auto Shop. There's a diner and a gas station. And then there's a huge trailer park uh, right beside it as well. Yeah, I don't really know... Um... I don't really know what to, um, where to go. Maybe we just stay where we are. So I think that turn off down there eventually leads to the military base, but it's like down some like windy dirt roads and stuff. Um, what was this turning? This turning here. Oh, okay, so this turning that I just passed 
leads back into all that farmland, which uh, we've been to it quite a bit, actually. Is there somewhere with a silo to fill with my fecal matter? <laughs> what the fuck was that? It's like a pod. It's a pod of zombies out here in the middle of nowhere. I almost plowed right into all of them too. There, there's, uh, I mean, it's pretty safe out here. There's no water out here, though. Not that I can see on the map. Up to the north, there's no little lakes or anything. So I guess uh, you wouldn't really want to live out here where there's no water. I think there's a couple of really isolated cabins that have, like, antique stoves and a well. If you can find, a, a, like, a, an isolated cabin that has a well, it's an it's, uh, infinite water source, right? I mean, you can't fish in it, but it's it's clean water for drinking and washing and all that. Could also just get water from a river and boil it. Yes, so yeah, you can, yeah, you're right. That is Okay, the first place I was talking about was this place. So see it's got like a little shed and a and it's got a garage. Just wanna see what these places look like and also see if there's like anything in them. They're like, they're ground floor though, so it's still like, quite spacious though. Eh. Yeah, I know I don't have to live above ground, but it's just safer, right? I, I just, I don't want to be like, uh, you know... In the middle of doing something and then fucking shit's knocking on your door and uh, it's annoying, eh? Like, no? I, I find I find that's like... I'd rather just live up and, and feel safe the whole time, you know? Below the ground is safer? But like six feet below the ground. Six feet under. Kind of came out of nowhere, those guys. <laughs> so. Okay, it's a gas station. I'm tired already.
I'm dead. I drove all the way out here just to get tired immediately. How? <laughs> fuck. How am I fucking tired at 3 o'clock in the afternoon? It's from all the driving, I guess. What time did we wake up at? Sleeping in the chair? Fuck. Let's go see if there's a house that we can just crash at. Resume in the in the morning. It's a lot of zombies down here though. Oh my god. What is this? Why are there so many bad guys down here? Oh, that's another one of these little sheds. Maybe I just gotta sleep in my car. That's not safe. Whoops. Can I steal a bed? Yeah, maybe I'm so tired because I didn't sleep in a bed, actually. That's a good point. It's, I'm sleeping on a chair all the time. I should try to steal a bed. That's a good idea. I have no idea where I am right now. Why are there so many zombies out here? What's even out here? What were they all doing? Farming? Secret rave parties? Look at all of them! Oh shit, that guy's got a duffel bag. As much as I want it, I, I, I can't fucking... I'm tired. I, I mean... He's in the middle of a field. You'd think it would be safe to get him. <laughs> the, the entire population of Louisville is has decided to spawn in these stupid fields. I think I'm heading home, but I don't know. I must be. I must be kind of close now, right? We've been driving forever.
I'm sleeping here. I don't even know where I am. This window is open. You want me to grab that bed? peaches. Tweezers, adhesive bandage. This bed I can take. It's a 60 chance to break. Um. Carpentry 2. Oh, nice. And metal work one, sure. Sorry, the visibility is really bad. I can't see anything. I think we'll eventually get back home if we just follow the road south as soon as we can, right? God, that road trip costs us a lot, actually. Our sleeping schedule is completely messed up. I think this is it. I think we're home.
I don't have any sleeping tablets or anything, do I? No, I have antidepressants. Okay, maybe we can get Carpentry Volume 2 read before noon. Can you build at all in this game? Yeah, yeah, you can. Absolutely, yeah. You can build. Oh, look, it's foggy today. Oh, shit. We're going to miss it. Okay, well, we hit three at least. We're almost done. Might as well just read it out now. Oh man, what a mess. This has turned into such a mess. I can't believe we went all the way out there for nothing. We got to we got to get a bed. We we got to try to get a bed. We gotta try to get some books. We gotta try to get some water. I can't believe the water's out. We need to start looking for a generator. Um, we There's so much we need to do that it doesn't involve a massive long road trip out to the middle of uh, nowhere just to get tired and have to turn back, right? We need to get the treadmill from the uh, water station. Yeah, day two water is pretty rough, yeah. We could build a tent, yeah. Maybe we just uh, base here and then build some stairs up to the roof and make the water collectors up there. Start working on the deck. Yeah, maybe that. I mean, maybe that's the, maybe that's the answer. You know, sometimes you don't want that to be the answer, but sometimes maybe that is just the answer. Quite simply. Just let the deck expand naturally. I think I'm lacking, um, whatchamacallit, screws. Not screws. Um, I think I'm, I'm, I'm missing some nails. One nail is all I need. Who followed me home? Hello, young man. Why are you on my property? We need some deck enlargement supplements. You're damn right we do. That's exactly what we need. You're not wrong about that. <gasps> There's free logs in there, by the way.
There's a pillow in here. The van got a little bit damaged. I'm not sure how, actually. Um, does seem to be some blood splatter on there, and... Um, I, don't, I don't really know what's going on. How come I can't put the... Uh, oh, yeah, it's because I don't actually have the sheet ropes on me. I like that. I like that I can get down into here and pick this lightwood desk up, for example. I like that I could fit a lightwood desk inside my satchel and then climb back up to safety. That's good. Maybe we can sleep on this desk. That might be fun. How come I can't uh, place this desk? Do I need to have both bits in my inventory? Ah, oh, here we go. What the heck is going on with this? Why won't it let me place it? Second piece too far away? I picked them both up, did I not? Where's the other bit? Oh, it's in my satchel. Okay, now I have both pieces. I, I don't even want to pl necessarily place it, I just want to disassemble it in, in peace without getting uh, killed. There. Okay, we need a box of nails or something would be good, right? <laughs> trapping, nice. Trapping, more trapping. Love trapping. Big, big trapping. All right. <laughs> Well, at least it's at least it is safe up here, right? We are uh, we are really depressed. Maybe it's time to take some antidepressants. We need to try to stay awake a bit long. I think we're so depressed because we're we're filthy. It doesn't like it. That might help a little bit.
Jefferson's death was fucking tragic. Man, wasn't it just? What a way to go, eh? You attach the wrong you attach the wrong thing onto your onto your toe hitch and then next thing you know you're dead. It was very swift, yeah. They 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 got him immediately. I just could I had no room to dash out of the car. We were moving so slow and there's so many of them. Fuck, they came from everywhere. Well, you learn, eh? You just, you, you learn, and then you learn, and then you learn some more. We'll just know not to attach a trailer to uh, our truck when uh, there's potentially a million bad guys around. You learn and you learn. The driving trade I have makes backing up loud? Fuck, really? Is that part of um, Speed Demon? I thought it just made you go fast. Plus 200% noise on reversing? Fuck, I don't, I don't know if I've ever even read that on a tooltip. Is that actually the case? Oh well. There you go. You win some and you lose some. Sorry, I'm just flossing my uh, nerve in my neck right now. Have you ever done this before? Do doing a, a neck nerve floss? I'm just going to try to advance time a little bit to see if we can get back into like some decent sleeping routine. We're really tired, but at least we're just sitting here, right? Go to bed at like 10. Perfect. Okay, it's not uh, going to rain today or anything. It is a little foggy though. We're at s maintaining 69. <laughs> Laugh, laugh it all up now. Get it out of your system. We're maintaining 69, okay? So, reversing like this is making a, a shit ton of noise, is what you're trying to say to me? I won't believe it. I, there's nothing in any of the tooltips that says that that's the case. I, it sounds loud, don't get me wrong, it does sound loud. But I don't think it, it actually gives a noise increase. We're flipping going for it again, okay? I will not be beat. Oh, shit. <laughs> it 
It's quite foggy. I was lighting. I was lighting up a smoke. So much of that one went flying everywhere. It's really gross. It's, it is a bit of a day trip out here, but I think if you leave nice and early, it's fine, right? I think if you can get out here nice and early and just put the pedal down to the metal, you get to your destination with a little bit of energy left. Look, we're making great time. It's only 7.30 and we've already passed the first turnoff for the military base. we got the farmland turnoff coming up. It's only 7.30 still. Can you believe it? There's the farmland turnoff, still only 7.30. We are absolutely cruising down this highway. All right, the turning should be coming up fairly soon. I anticipate around 8 o'clock, maybe, the turning. It's not a hard turn. Shit, it's not a hard turn either. It's a gradual turn. Jesus. Seven fifty? Come on. Come on, game sense and intuition. Don't let me down. Oh yeah, look at that. Actually ahead of schedule. Ten minutes ahead of schedule. Whoa. Perfect. Perfect. Nice nice to uh nice to be early, actually. Really good. Okay, it's only 8 o'clock. There's a good chance that we won't miss Woodcraft today. We're just, just going to be a really quick in and out. We'll try to get some food while we're out here. See, hopefully, if we can get a cool army helmet. Maybe some a new jacket. A large backpack. <coughs> maybe some sort of, like, a SAS balaclava or... Um, some safety goggles, I'm thinking. Could be a trailer out here that we could pick up too. That might be fun. Might be really fun to not attach the trailer to the van and instead attach a very heavy truck to the back of the van. That could be good, actually. I'd be down for that. Whoops. <laughs> I'm back. It's me again. <laughs> Sorry. Alright, smoke them if you got them. The drop zone is coming up. you at the drop zone. Oh. Uh, Roger, Roger. This is Rashan. I am uh, commencing my drop into Tomato Town. Uh, well, shit. It's busy down here. It gets so busy. I think I actually missed the turning. I did. It's up here.
There's no two liter um, bottle of cola here this time. Oh, hello, are you the proprietor of this fine establishment? Military urban camo shorts. This guy's got a gas mask. he got a wooden spear on him. I think there's still somebody in here with us. Oh, I think this guy is the proprietor. He's got a shell's bandolier on him. Okay, I managed to... Okay, duffel bag? Sure. Why not? For now, it's better than nothing, right? How about we grab this winter hat as well? Wooly hat and scarf? Not that I'm expecting to um, survive long enough to use it all, but... It's fun to pretend, no? Oh yeah, look it, there are a couple of nasty bitches back here. Hey guys, what's up? Turns out we didn't even need the key anyway. It's a massacre back here. Jeez. Yeah. Yep. I'm gonna grab a cot to sleep on. Yeah, absolutely. There's an army coat here. Loads of ammo that we don't really... Again, we don't really need this right now. So many keys. There's nothing in the satchel. Okay, unlucky. I don't think there's an army helmet here or a big backpack. Well, we can check the clothes racks actually, but I was hoping for those things. Would have been great. The army coat? Bite defense, scratch defense, and bullet defense? Minus... What am I wearing right now? Oh, it's cuz uh it's cuz it's not better than the um bulletproof jacket, right? So hiking bag, 20. Okay, this is better than the duffel. Can you guys hear that? Like in the far distance, the air raid siren? It's like very, very subtle. You can just hear it.
It sounds like it's really far away. Military urban camo pants. They're not better than what I've got right now. More painkillers? I picked up a boonie hat. I hear somebody out there. There's a couple of you out here. What's up? Okay, we're missing woodcraft, unfortunately, but... What can you do, eh? Okay, Rashad. We need a little bit of food. We're gonna go into this supermarket, hopefully. Get some tins. If we can peel like a couple of them off and whittle them down that way, then we can get in there. I'm smoking. Okay, we fought for this. 
let's get in here and get some food. It's like a little farmer's market, I think. It's all locked up. I wonder if the produce is still... Oh. Got any smokes? No oh, plastic bags, though. Flour, gum. Here we go. My favorite, I love milk. All the lettuce is rotten. Oh, yeah. This should keep us going for a while. Okay, let's get the frick out of here. Let's see if there's some nice fresh meats that we can eat on the way out. Some salamis or something? Nope. How about some cakes? Mmm. Hopefully they're not rotten. They're all rotten. <laughs> oh man. Some stale pie? Some rotten donuts? Oh. That's unfortunate. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. 178 kills with the axe. How's the axe looking? Probably worth checking. It's not doing too hot. We have a backup, though, at home. And uh, we, if, when we can be bothered, we can go and uh, clear at the fire station as well. All right. A couple of things to note today. The army surplus has been scoped out. We got a couple of bits and pieces. We got a bag upgrade. Crucially, we now have a bed. It is it is an army cot, but hey, if it's good enough for our brave boys, it's good enough for me. I'd say that's a successful road trip. And we're heading home just as we're getting sleepy. Sorry, brave, brave, brave soldiers, I should say. Not brave boys. Sorry. That's very insensitive of me. Hey, Sleazy Drunk, thanks so much for the 200 bits. I can't really read that whole wall of text right now. Uh, hang on. Um, here you go, Sips. I got these bits from doing a Twitch survey. Love your shit and love the fact no matter how many people you toss towards the zombie horde, you always come back. Keep it up. If you ever install Hydrocraft mod adds lots of shit like dairy farming and beehives and even making biodiesel. Sleazy Drunk, that sounds cool, actually. Thanks so much for the 200 bits. I appreciate it. And uh, Jobu23, thank you so much for the 100 bits as well. I did get the cot. I got the... He said... Get the cot six head, but I already picked it. I got it. I took the cot. Shh, almost. Did I? Yeah, I'm sure I did. Fuck, maybe I didn't. Did I not take it? I'm sure I took it. I put it in my bag. I got the flag. I got the duffel bag and the boonie hat. Fuck! Hey, where is it? 
Where's my... Oh, we're, we cannot go back. It's too risky. I left it on the floor like last time. I'm sure I picked it up. Oh, does it uh, does it turn into a box? Oh, that's why. Fuck. I didn't. I thought he just picked it up. I didn't think it turned it into a little uh, IKEA box. That's why. All right. Well, something to go back for. Or not. I mean, we'll just take another bed. We'll uh, we'll have to hit Rosewood. Uh, we'll have to hit the uh, the neighborhoods in uh, Rosewood anyway, right? So we'll uh, we'll grab a bed from there. Oh man, I was really looking forward to having a nice sleep on my new military cot. Fuck. Curse the interface in this game sometimes, you know? Like, what? sometimes stuff picks up and sometimes it breaks down into an Ikea box. Like, uh, man, I don't know. You could pick up like a, uh, like a full cupboard and it doesn't break down into a box. And then you pick up like a small cot and it turns into a box. I don't actually mind the UI. I think I think there's just some weird inconsistencies sometimes, right? I mean, it's a it's it's a game that's been around for a long time, so it's understandable. That's a large backpack. I'm a little tired. greed it gets you every time well gets me every time it de it definitely gets me every time Where is it now? It's on this pile, right? I can't even see it now. There it is. Let's sort it out when we get home. Holy crap, we're so tired. I got gloves already. I got some leather gloves. I definitely am wearing some. The van is drifting slightly. <laughs> it's probably quite damaged from all of the collisions. None of them are my fault, by the way, just saying. It's all the zombie guts, yeah, Dow, you're right. It's all the zombie guts caught up in the caught up in the wheels and whatnot.
Okay, we're almost home. Um, the, the good news is that the, there's nothing in the van, so we can just park up and just climb right on up. Whoops. Hey, maybe that's correct. Yeah, it has. Look. It's trying to drift the other side now, but in a, in a way, it's corrected it. Oh, what happened here? We have to def we have to defend our fortress here. <sighs> okay. Uh, wh hey, what is this? It's five fifty. What is the timing on this woodcraft? We got one. What is the timing on that? So is there no six o'clock shows? Oh, God. I can't believe I didn't bring the bed. That's so annoying, eh? God, that's so annoying. Oh, looks like we're gonna get a uh, wilderness <laughs> this fucking state of me. <laughs> yes, mm, very interesting television. Ooh, foraging, nice. I'm glad we didn't miss this one. Okay. Oh, yeah, baby. Can you believe that? That went pretty good. And now we have an awesome USA flag to hang up. And we got some winter clothing, too. Not that we'll ever need it, but I think it's still kind of cool, though. Look, I got the bell, the uh, the open balaclava on, and my beard still sticks out. Very nice. It's probably gonna make me even um, even more hot, but so we want to place. Oh, it's uh, we gotta unpack it right to place it. That's great. Oh, man, that's good. So we got a duffel bag and a hiking bag. Spare. I think I think eventually this bad boy has to go outside, right? We'll put this bad boy outside and enjoy it from our deck. Let me store it here just for now. Cuz we can go and rescue that barbecue. We'll have a huge flag and a barbecue out there. I think that's going to be so awesome.
We got a spare hand axe here if we need it. Okay, nice. We got a little collection of uh, bits and pieces now. Very good, very good. All we need is a barbecue and an American flag. That's exactly it. That's exactly it. Okay, let's eat some chips. How's our weight doing? 70 and we're on the rise too. Okay, good. We've been absolutely going nuts with food, which is really good. Well, we could have slept on a cot tonight if I wasn't so stupid. God, I'm stupid. Fuck! Fucking... Fuck! I'm so fucking stupid! Fuck, I wish I wasn't so fucking stupid! <laughs> Don't hurt your shoulder. Uh, I could go back for the cot. You know, I'm tempted to go back for the cot, even. Alright, let's switch this bad boy on. Let's read and listen to the radio and watch TV all at the same time. That's going to be nuts. Okay. What do we got? 30% humidity, maximum of 20 degrees, no problem. Clear skies, just how I like them. Tomorrow, even less humidity, maximum of 19.2 degrees. Clear skies, periodical cloudy spells. Okay, I can deal with that. Period of weather predicted to start in the afternoon. Expecting light to moderate rain. All right, we'll go and collect some reading materials in that case. Might be a good day to hit the books store, right? Get some, uh, get some books. Could be good. Stay indoors for all that rain. Okay, good. All right, I'm going to place my book here so I can finish reading it. Um, let's have a quick smoke. No, uh, no helicopter event expected today by the looks of it. Okay, 71 and rising. Perfect. All right, let's take some jerky with us and um, let's take uh, a couple of bags of chips with us too. We can snack on those uh, while we're out in the field. Slaying. Okay, this axe still is still going. Still do something with it. Fuck off, bitch. Thank you. Come on, get out of here. Get out of my field! Oh, that horn's quite loud, eh? Look at that. It's attracted them from all over the damn place.
Okay, the bookstore is probably not uh, not the best today. It's quite busy down here, actually. Let's do the loop and see about getting into the school. Steal some books from there, maybe. All right, so many zombies stuck in the back of the fire yard here. <laughs> Shit. ready for some early morning slaying. Which window are you at? I love the uh, the the panicking moodlet. <laughs> it looks so good. Oh, there's a couple of them back here. Oh, it's all locked up. Who's around here? There's quite a few of them out here. Okay. Let's just rest for a minute. have a smoke and some chips. Okay, and let's sneak in 
go to the library, hopefully. Oh. Hello. Is anybody actually in the library? All right, we're basically just looking for volume ones for now. Farming volume one, no. Farming volume one, no. Tailoring one, yeah. Mechanics one, yeah. Uh, let's get fishing one. Let's get metalwork one, no. Cooking one, I don't think we need. Uh oh. Mechanics, metalwork, trapping, carpentry, we don't need. Okay, we're going to have to be quick here. Uh, electrician one, yep. Trapping one, sure. Tailoring, trapping, tailoring, first aid one, I'll take it. Cooking two, yep. Uh, fishing, cooking, tailoring, trapping, no. We've got all those. I don't want to get snuck up on. The farming magazine, cooking, fishing, cooking, good cooking. Uh, I don't care about the magazines right now. I know we'll just get them eventually, doesn't matter. Ah, okay, let's grab that. Forging, fishing, electrician, carpentry, I think we need carpentry too, right? And then we'll take three as well. All right. That was pretty decent. We have plenty of food and reading materials for uh, the bad weather that's coming up. <laughs> oh my lord. Quite busy around here, isn't it? It's quite a few, quite a few zombies. We're gonna have to figure out where we can get a generator from. Probably check some of these garages. Although it's very busy up here too. Good grief! Good God. Oh, they didn't move very fast at all. <laughs> I was hoping that they would have moved down the other way, but they have not.
There's a lot of them in Rosewood this time around. There's so many of them just up here. Look at all of them. Fucking hell. Look at all of them! Why are there so many by my house? <laughs> so many super nasty bitches. They come from the the horn is so loud. They come from miles. I eat a bit of jerky to celebrate, I think. I bet you guys didn't think that today was going to be the day. day we went out searching for our lost companion. Where the hell is he? Oh, it must mean we're back this way. The day I die? I'm not dying today. I think that, I think we're absolutely wrecking the truck though. Look, they can almost walk faster than I'm driving my truck right now. Uh, well, that's not good. I think that I think off-roading with the truck is not the plan. coffee yeah the van oh there he is
Sometimes you just gotta shove a whole barbecue into your backpack. Okay, I'm gonna have to go back and rescue the van now. Seems that every time we go out to that field, <laughs> we leave something behind. When are we gonna go to Louisville? I don't know if you've been watching me play this much. <laughs> it's not happening. I can't even get out of Rosewood. Oh. Okay, this escape rope is still there. Okay, I thought we were going to die there. I honestly, I thought that was it. I thought we had it. I thought we'd had it. Okay, there's some there are some nasty bitches out there. I can hear them. But guess what? They can't get up here. I forgot the cot again, yeah. Don't judge me. Okay, we got a couple of books though. And we got a really good... Uh, we got how to use generators as well, so it's not all bad. There's going to be some bad weather. And also, I think we want to um, probably wait for some of these zombies to, to move along, right? All right, so skills-wise, carpentry... Oh, carpentry 2... Um, I read already. That's annoying. So we need. We actually needed carpentry 3, which I think I took 2, right? Yeah, I did. God, I'm so smart. Okay, cooking 2, um, we can read. Ahead of uh, the cooking show tomorrow. It's going to start to rain. <laughs> oh, this is teaching me carpentry. It's the water barrel one. Good. Too much reading and not enough heavy drinking. True. Okay. Today... Periodicals, cloudy spells, and there should be some weather. Afternoon, light to moderate rain. Okay. Tomorrow. Clouds, Ed. Light to moderate rain. It doesn't look like there's a chopper thing happening today.
Okay. Cooking. We don't want to miss woodcraft today either, right? I th we're just chilling today. We have to just chill today. It's been too much. It's been a lot, right? It's been a lot. Okay, good. Cooking volume two is finished. Let me grab electrician volume one. Alright, here we go. Woodcraft. No! Where's my woodcraft? Shit. Okay, what's on tonight? It hasn't started raining yet. It was meant to rain this afternoon. There's the rain. It started. No wilderness survival tonight either? Is that it for TV shows? Are we done? Okay, Electrician Volume 1 is done. Which is great, because that means that we can now disassemble watches and stuff. Earbuds? That's good. Um, right. So, skills we need, uh, first aid mechanics would be a good one. We got a car zone tape, too. I think? Did we get a car zone tape? We did? Okay, so we read mechanics, volume one now. We should eat something, too. I think there might be some bad guys outside. <laughs> I think there might be one or two bad guys out there. Do, 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 do. Oh, the vegetable soup was not enough. We're going to have to eat some... Let's eat some cold spaghetti bolognese as well. Mm. I'd eat it. Okay, that's done it. We'll read. We'll go to bed at 10.30 tonight. Is there cooking? Yes. This might be one of the last shows. No, there's no cooking. I think that's it. I think all the TV shows are done. Fuck, that's so depressing, isn't it? We wasted so much time going to that army surplus, and for what? We I can hear them outside. Uh, we got the large backpack, but we didn't even get it at the surplus. We got it up some random on the road. Yeah, that van has been on that whole time out in that field. <laughs> we should have left a brick on the uh, on the horn. We could have attracted loads of them out there. That could have been really good. Okay, mechanics. One. That's great. We got the full uh, thing, so we could probably watch um, Car Zone Episode 2, right? We got two skill-ups last time we did this. It was fantastic. It 
which made it so that we could hotwire stuff, right? All we need to do is get electrical up to one. Look at that. Half th halfway through mechanics one already. One thing. Just get a new car. That's very expensive, Fred. Maybe your engine's easy to fix. Here we go. Tell us how to do it, Jimmy. That's great. It's just a noise problem. You might need a muffler. But if it's something more serious, you're going to need some engine parts. Halfway through. If you don't have any, ask at your local scrapyard. Or take a wrench and dismantle an old car if you have one and the skills. One more. Oh, you beauty. That's so good, isn't it? Fuck, that's great. Wow, I fixed it all by myself. Fred, you replaced the engine with a hamster in a bean can. That won't work. Oh, dang. Fred and Jimmy in the car zone. <laughs> that's good. Okay, nice. All right, good. So, um... We got mechanics too from watching one tape. All we need is electrical one, and we can uh, and we can uh, hotwire cars. So we should be able to get some uh, some other sets of wheels, right? We'll have to go liberate the gas cans from our uh, van. We need to uh, we need to get our um, which call it up as well carpentry so that we can make some rain barrels so that we can at least wash right all right we're gonna have to do that tomorrow i gotta go it's late um listen it uh it's it it has been a time we're uh we're on run 12 with uh, Rashad Howe, who's had a couple of tight scrapes, but is, all, is, is doing pretty good. I mean, we've been alive for nine days and five hours. We've killed 222 zombies in that time. We've also, we've been to the army surplus store. We've got a large backpack. We've got uh, some backup weapons. We managed to get a sledgehammer really early, which has been great, which is what's kept us safe up here this whole time for all of our reading and everything. Um, so we'll, uh, we'll carry on tomorrow and try to be more careful and uh, not attach trailers when we're in the middle of um, the danger zone, like we did today with uh, <laughs> that other guy. <laughs> Jefferson. Fucking Jefferson. Chat, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. I hope you had a fun time. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, whatever you end up doing. And uh, thanks so much for uh, watching. Thanks for the support. Thanks for the subs, resubs, gift subs, donations, supers. Thanks for watching on YouTube if you're watching on YouTube. And thanks for watching on Twitch if you're watching on Twitch. I appreciate all the support. Thank you very much. Have a good one. And I'll see you tomorrow. All right, chat. LOL. Lots of love. See you then. Peace. Bye now. Bye.